Landmark buildings are becoming luxury residential towers, and they are pulling in sky-high prices. That's right. Alice Mars here now with How New York's real estate trend. This is the new one, and I get the allure of this. This oh, is really yes. cool to live in one of these famous Amazing. buildings. Oh, like these the buildings are, building. yeah, you walk in and you just feel the history of mm. New York. They are incredible. These are gorgeous Art Deco buildings that just scream Gotham and old New York. They are bringing together historic finishes with modern amenities, and they are the hottest things on the market right now. In an amazing historic 1927 Art Deco tower by the iconic architect Ralph Walker. This was originally built as a telephone uh, operations headquarters uh, uh, office building. A New York City landmark is becoming one of the hottest luxury properties in town. 100 Barclay on West Street, next to One World Trade, otherwise known as the Verizon Building, is becoming a combination of commercial and condos. David Kaufman, Alexa Home and Travel Editor at the New York Post, took us on a tour. Because it's landmark, it would be very, very difficult to completely overhaul the space. So what they've done is they're keeping the lobby as an operational entryway, uh, uh, a welcome space for the phone company, and then half of the lobby will be converted into a luxurious, glamorous, beautiful amenities and experience space for the apartment. This mix of Art Deco and Ultra Modern is bringing in some big money. The model penthouse is nearly 4,000 square feet with four bedrooms and a $12 million price tag. They're developing over 150 apartments between one and five bedrooms, $2.5 million to over $12 million. You have beautiful details like uh, oak, white oak herringbone floors, lots of modern art, really tall ceilings. Further uptown in Hell's Kitchen, another Art Deco telephone building designed by Ralph Walker is also making a name for itself. This is Stella Tower, named after Ralph Walker's wife, Stella. And it's now at the very end stages of becoming a new luxury 51 uh, unit residential condominium boutique condo. But because this building isn't landmarked, there's more room to modernize. And once again, the combination of old and new is raising the ceiling on prices. There are one to three bedrooms, 1.8 million to 14 million dollars, which is a record for Hell's Kitchen. There's four penthouses, two are on the market. This one is about 3,700 square feet with over 1,000 square feet of outdoor space. The terraces have extraordinary views and a glimpse of the building's beautiful Art Deco crown, which lights up at night. And thanks to local zoning, those sight lines will never go away. This building is located in a part of Hell's Kitchen that's been zoned for only buildings six floors or lower. So none of the surrounding uh, real estate around here will go above that six floor uh, limit, which means that all of these incredible views to the river, to Midtown, to, to downtown, all these views are, are basically going to stay here you know, for a long, long time. Another awesome thing about these buildings, because they were initially built for industrial purposes, the structures are rock solid. Everything from the beams mm, right. to the floors, ceilings, as strong, stable, and soundproof as you can find. And 100 Barclay, the first place we showed you, they're putting in over 40,000 square feet of amenities, including two pools. Honestly, like, why would you ever leave your building? So true. <laughs> I need a new apartment so bad. Wow, that's incredible. We got a couple. I we, can't afford we that. We got a couple. Though, we can tell you, Steve. Come on. It, it's like a, it's like a pro sport here, sort of lusting after other people's apartments, isn't it? I mean, there's so many amazing apartments. Oh, people with endless money. Forget about oh. pro sport. I do it for a living. I go and look at these that's apartments incredible. and go home and just thank God I'd love to live I in know. one of these. Amazing. <laughs>